Okay, testing. Okay. So, at the request of a friend, I decided to start doing my own, like, vocal commentaries as I play Persona 4. And so I figured, why not? Probably be easier. So at the time of this recording... Hold up. So at the time of this recording... I... am looking for a priestess... Which I do not have. Ditch this guy for now. As I was saying before... I... Just a few minutes ago, finished watching the last few episodes of a series called Aria. If you've never heard of it, I don't blame you, but you should definitely, definitely check it out. It is officially my favorite series ever of all time. Made me cry. Crap. Controller issues. They, luckily, they seem to go away pretty quickly. Anyway. Back to business. A priestess. Now you may notice I've been doing things to get my stats up even though I really didn't need to. That's because I'm following a guide trying to do this to the letter. And fortunately, hello Yuplica. Oh. Anyway, as I was saying, um the reason I've been doing those strange things is to yeah. try and follow a guide to the letter for maxing all social links round one. I've also been doing something similar with Persona 3 Portable, and that's actually been working out pretty good. Anyway, a book about job certification. <laughs> You know, the first time I played this game, when I realized just how beneficial the teammates' lengths were for battle, I immediately shifted my focus to just maxing all my teammates' lengths. You may notice I'm not commenting on this. This is like uh, fourth time I've seen this. This is my fourth playthrough. Earlier at the beginning, you may have noticed I had a separate playthrough, like set in the number two slot. Now that is for um. That is for me to try and fuse Izanagi no Okami. Like, just because I could. And I thought it would be a little easier. But, at the point I am in the game, I can pretty much wipe out any enemy with little to no effort. Like, I actually have to chain enemy encounters together in order to get any decent amount of experience or money and that's still not enough, I'm like four levels away
rank up to. I'll see you later. So cute. Yeah, this is like fourth play for playthrough, like I said. And we are not doing that tonight, unfortunately. Do, 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 do. Now four playthroughs for me, that's actually pretty rare. Usually after one I lose interest for a while. But this one's actually managed to keep my attention. That should tell you something. Do I have another book? Yeah, the guide says at this point that there was supposed to be another book on sale. I guess I... missed it. Whatever. I got other stuff I can do up here. Translation. Of all the jobs you can do in your room at night, this one's the one that makes the most. Especially, like, if you get your little pick-a-thing event, whatever, and you pick the right one. Or the one you pick just to, happens to decide it wants to be the right one. 526. Oh! That is what we are going to be doing today. Oh, hi, Chie. Yo! Persona 3 Portable for the... Ugh. I cannot for the life of me remember. Hieroglyphs. Persona 4. We make learning fun. Shadow Kanji, this, this time around, did not exactly go the way I had planned. second because the screen for me is kind of dark. I'll be back in just a second. 
Okay, we're back. Hello, Yukiko. Oh! Again. Yes! Yeah, one big thing... Actually, I was gonna say I played... Well, I did play this before Persona 3, but... The first Persona game I ever played was actually Arena. Yeah, not the best starting, starting point, I know. In fact, when I actually got around to playing Persona 4, I pretty much forgot everything except, like, one <sighs> thing that apparently turned out to be a spoiler. And that is, spoiler alert, Naoto is female. And at first... Hold up. Huh? Like, at first, when everyone started calling Naoto a boy, I was like, Naoto's a girl, right? And like, it got to the point where I was doubting myself. I'm like, have I been wrong this whole time? Then sure enough, she gets tossed into the TV. Actually, on Twitter, I was live tweeting as I was playing. Yes. And I kept pointing out that Naoto is female, and this friend of mine, who was the one who suggested I do this commentary, pointed out that I apparently already spoiled it for myself. Although, really, that was the only thing from Arena I actually remember. That and the fact that I guess exists. Existed. Oh, Yukiko. <laughs> I doubt she's as bad a cook as Fuka, though. You know, like, I was playing the other day, and I was like, I don't get how Fuka's mind works when it comes to cooking. It's like, all it really is, like, at the core, is just following directions. And it's like, she's so good with machines, how, sh how could mm -hmm. she possibly screw that up? I mean, there's talent, and then there's common sense. I'll see you later. I don't know. Anyway, that's enough rambling for now.